Hi, welcome to Carol Joe's. I am Carol, the owner and creator of all the items that you find at caroljoes.com. Today, I'm going to show you how to condition your thread when you are working with projects that use needle and thread to create um, your jewelry design. Um, I use a lot of times the size B Nymo thread. And when you use Nymo thread, it's a cotton thread and it needs conditioning so that it doesn't fray as you're working on your projects. So what you can use is either beeswax or you can use a thread conditioner. I happen to prefer beeswax over a thread conditioner. So let me show this to you how I do it. Well, number one, you go and take the amount of thread that you're gonna want for your project, measure it off, and then cut it off. Off screen here, you can't see it, but I'm measuring out my thread. And then I'm cutting it off. Your thread will come off of that spool kind of kinky. So go ahead and pull on it. I just go ahead and pull with both hands a little bit at a time and get those kinks out. What, by getting those kinks out when you're working on your project, you will not have the stretch to your project and it will allow you to uh, have your project nice and tight. So I just sit here and pull on it until it gets straight. If I need to do a couple pulls on each one, that's fine. If I need to go back through it again, I will. I just at the end of the day, see how it lays so much better? That's what you want. Then I take my beeswax and on the end here, I'm just gonna pull that through like three or so times. I always extra condition my ends. Once I've extra conditioned my ends, I just take this and put it in there and just pull it through. Just pull a little bit at a time. It will see, if you notice, it's just sitting right there on top. Go ahead and pull, pull, pull all the way through all of the thread that you have for your project. And then we're gonna get close here. We're almost there. We're getting close to the end of my thread. And if you notice, it's going down in there. That is fine. Then do a, like three swipes here on the end. And that is how you condition your thread. I hope you found this information useful. Have a wonderful day. Bye.